Hey, what's going on, Big Dick? So today, just a little bit of a talk over. Um, I'm going to be talking about Magic in the EOC and how Jax once again has kind of nerfed. Well, I guess you can't say kind of because they they definitely have nerfed Magic now. The ancient Magics, at least. Um, you know, the whole point of doing ancient Magics is normally because you can you know barrage two things or so, three things, whatever pile stuff, right? So it kind of helps when you have a task like Blood Belts or you know Black Demon sometimes. Any task that you know obviously more than one target. So they did a nerf a little while ago that brought uh, this, the offhand mage. It would always hit about 50% of what the main hand would hit. Or something around there. It used to hit just like 50-50 or 100% to 100%. So it used to be the same ratio. Um, then they brought it down to worse. So, you know, your second target would never be, you know, as much. Uh, you wouldn't have hit as high on it. And now they brought it to a point basically where you actually can't momentum it. Now right now in this clip I am using abilities. As you guys can see, nothing has actually changed. Um, you hit the exactly same with using abilities with magic as you would before this nerf. Um, it is still by far a better experience per hour using uh, abilities, but of course, you know, using abilities a whole day is not that much fun. Um, sometimes you obviously want to use momentum. Now, in the second clip, you guys will see me at uh, Blood Belts. I will be using momentum at them, and it is completely shit. Um, a few hits these days, you can actually see your guy hitting like 100 with an ancient spell or the, you know, Blood uh, Fire Barrage or Burst. Um, I'll put a link in the description if I still have a link. Uh, Richard sent it to me. He was killing Dark Beast and he hit a 16 on one with one of the mage spells, the offhand spell, I think, and like 137 um, on the other one, which is very shit compared to the, you know, we used to hit like 2000s with their um, mage, and now we're hitting like 120th of that or some shit. I'm not sure how accurate this is, but he told me that hitting a 16 right now on EOC is like hitting a .006 uh, pre-EOC, so... You know how you take your rapier back in the day and you poke a one? Well, this is like hitting a point zero zero six, so it's a huge nerf. Now you don't hit sixteen all the time, but that was a very little fucking hit. But your main hand will hit like a thousand, thousand two hundred sometimes, but your off hand will definitely start hitting like three hundred to two hundred, and sometimes a hundred, depending on your slayer task. Now is this a good thing? I think they personally have touched the magics a bit too much. The first nerf was okay. The off hand, you know, if you're barraging one thing, the second thing that you're getting that's uh, getting attacked. Probably shouldn't be losing the same amount of HP as your main thing. Uh, that kind of made a little bit of sense. I understand Mage was very OP. It was like, I, I think it was like 600k experience an hour at the Abyssal Walkers, which is a lot of experience. And it turned out to be like 350k after the nerf or 400k, which is a little more reasonable compared to uh, melee and ranging. It's like exactly the same experience per hour on different training methods. But now it's been shot to complete crap. Now, one good thing about this is that, well, it's not really good for me because I have like 3 million death runes, which have crashed. Um, but yeah, using abilities, you actually don't use many runes at all when you use abilities. Um, you know, obviously you'll hit a lot and you won't uh, be using as many runes. So you save a lot of runes now, but you do obviously have to use a lot of clicking. It feels like right now, basically, momentum in this game is complete shit. It basically lowers your experience by over half an hour. Like half of your experience you'd be getting by the hour if you use momentum so using abilities with like mage you know you'll get like whatever experience uh, but using abilities you get a lot more now with mage it's a bit different because the ancient spells you can obviously attack more than one target but with range and melee it's like 400k an hour um with uh just using momentum it's like 150 to like 200k an hour i mean i guess i can understand from jax's point of view that like you know their whole point of making the oc was for so we use abilities but they did also, uh, you know, tell us that, you know, you can also activate momentum, which basically works just like pre-EOC type of thing. And you're going to hit a little bit less, but you're, you know, you're still going to be killing it pretty efficiently. Now, this nerf definitely uh, makes that look like a joke. I think momentum is one of those things that would make people actually give this a chance, in case, you know, in case they didn't want to use abilities. Um, they never used abilities. They, you know, they quit before EOC came out. Um, now, knowing that momentum hardly even works that well anymore compared to, like, using abilities, you know, it kind of just, I don't know, I, I don't think it'll be as good for people. I think being able to tell people that have never played EOC, Momentum is almost just as good as using abilities, and it's just like pre-EOC, it, it might make them want to actually try it out. But now it's just like, hey, if you use Momentum, which is like pre-EOC, it's like half the experience per hour, and it's shit, and you might have been dying. But yeah, Slayer has taken a pretty big hit on the experience per hour with this update, or downgrade, or nerf, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I believe Abyssal Demons are now about 150k experience per hour, which is still quite amazing, but this task about a month ago was almost 300k experience an hour. The first mage nerf made it like 200k an hour, 225 or so, and now it made about 150k with this other nerf. So this, this, these magics have had two nerfs in the past month, which is fucking crazy. But yeah, to me, I personally hate when Jax does stuff like this, where they take something that was awesome and make it completely shit. 
Um, I mean, like, it's just, like, why change it now? Like, why, you know, people got, like, 200 mil magic or defense at 600k mage an hour, um, literally, like, a month, less than a month, three weeks, two weeks, and then they nerf it, and then they nerf it again. It's just, like, why, like, I mean, this game is easy. What are you trying to do, make it hard again? I mean, if you, if you guys see that someone's getting a crazy amount of experience, right, check the tracker. If someone gained a lot of experience in a day, go look at their actual log and go see what they trained on. And then it, from that, you take it and you nerf it right there. You don't need to leave it in the game for fucking three months, and they're like, oh, wait, we gotta nerf that shit. Too many people are having fun doing that method. We need to nerf it now. It's too, you know, it's kind of too late, you dumbasses. I'm going to say, if people have trained there for more than two weeks, don't bother nerfing anymore because you're going to hear a lot of bitching from people like me that fucking, you know, now they missed out on a lot of experience. And people I'm competing with saved a lot of time because they did this method. So it just, it really fucks people over. But anyways, um, that is what I want to talk about today, I guess, for this video. Uh, mage did get nerfed, but obviously ability, um, you know, using abilities did not get affected at all by it. I can see, like, I mean, I'm still, you know, one hitting, two hitting, whatever, or I guess you can call it one ability and two ability and I don't know, you use two abilities and you kill it, so I don't know what else you'd call it. Um, but yeah, all I can say is.